Uh, we're here with Dylan Davis, freshman from Washington. Dylan, uh, thanks for taking some time out. And how have your first couple of weeks of practice been? Uh, it's been a lot of fun. Uh, like Michael said, I agree. It's just, you know, the game changes a lot. A lot of speed differential, and um, it's a lot of fun. You know, I like the competition, and I like trying to get better. And that's what I've been doing this whole time I've been here, just getting better. Uh, as we film in this, it's about ten days away from the first game. Just uh, describe what you're feeling about going down to Santa Barbara. Pretty anxious, pretty excited. Um, I'm not. I don't think I'm nervous yet. I bet you I will be once I step on the field and everything. But as of now, I'm just ready to go and can't really wait to get down there in some warm weather and get ready to start playing against some competition. You've been uh, you've been playing the outfield and pitching. Tell me what it's like the balance being a hitter and a pitcher. Uh, you know it's tough, but you got to find the happy medium. You got to find what you need to work on that day during practice. If there's more pitching stuff one day, more hitting, you got to just differentiate and. Um, do whatever you need to to get better, to be the best you can be, and that's what I've been trying to do is find you know, the happy medium between both of them. Tell me, what's it uh, been like coming to college baseball and, and having a teammate like Michael out of high school, you know, and coming here and being teammates then and now being teammates here too? Uh, you know, it's pretty cool, I would say. Uh, I don't know how many people actually get really to do that. I've never really seen, or I mean, I guess some, you know, other schools, but I mean, I was the first one knowing. Um, that like Michael and I would be coming here at the same time and it was just kind of like a cool experience. We've known each other since we were like 10 and we've grown up together and we're pretty much like brothers now so it's just kind of like a cool experience to get to share this with him, play on the same team and hopefully win a national championship together. You know, you say that, but ironically, we have three sets of high school teammates on this club, and like you that's said, that's, true, yeah. that's very, very rare, especially to have multiple sets. You think maybe that just helps out with this kind of this family atmosphere that this program is all about? You know, I do. I think that... Uh, we, you know, you come in knowing somebody and you feel a little more comfortable and a little more excited and ready to go. You don't feel like too many nerves about, i got to meet these guys, got to meet these guys. You know, you've been down here before. I came down with Michael a couple of times and hung out with Matt Boyd and Tony Bryant and met some of the other players and, you know, just get a nice feel for the whole team and not really too nervous about coming down here. Just more excited and ready to go. Now we're talking after uh, the team scrimmaged on Tuesday and you're wearing your black uniform top, pretty much the new, the newest uniform yeah. that the club's going to see. Yeah. Uh, just some thoughts on it. Uh, I mean, I really like it. I definitely like the black uh, tops. Makes it look pretty cool and everything. And I know they didn't have anything last year like this, but I was always wondering if they're going to do something like it. And it's mm -hmm. kind of cool. First, you know, Pac-12 jersey and wear the black, and I like it a lot. <laughs> All right, Dylan. We appreciate your time and good luck in a couple weeks. Thank you.